It was discovered by the court that the amended charge has not, uh, the, uh, the defendant, two defendants, uh, the, uh, the charge was amended from four people to two because two others are at large. On that ground, there has to be a fresh plea. And that was the basis of today's adjournment. The case is further adjourned to the 24th and 25th of February for trial and plea of both defendants. However, we applied to the court to allow the defendants access to their personal physician. And the court granted the application and held that the defendants will have to be alive to be able to stand trial. On that ground, their personal physicians are allowed to attend to them, of course, under the supervision of the prison management, um, prison doctors. Okay, so um, since the, we are transferred from the custody of the DSS down the to the uh, correctional facility, have you been able to have access to your clients? Yes, yes. How stable is your health condition? Very, very bad. It's not stable. The health situation is very bad. Uh, the wife is currently on... Uh, yeah. She can't walk, you know. Whereas before the incident of December 14th, 2015, she was working on her feet. It's not possible now for her. And that was one of the reasons why they couldn't be in court today. Their condition is getting worse by the day. People are worried about this incessant uh, adjournment. Which were, which were worried? I was prepared for a trial because I also want the case speedily mm. concluded. Since the government has decided to proceed with the trial, without obeying the order of the Federal High Court. The government has now said they want to go on with the trial. We are ready. And we are very, very embarrassed that any time this case comes up, uh, the whole town is paralyzed. It's not fair for the residents in the state. And that is why we are going to speed up. We are going to ensure that the trial is sped up. Okay. So what are the amended charges sir. like? You know, the same charges. The same charges, but the two uh, the where the number of the defendants has been reduced to two from four. But essentially, the charges are the same. Thank you.